I headed to the line for Moto One. Do a little, uh, little gate packing. Like so we can get the whole shot. First moto, first qualifier is uh, 40, 40 plus. So you try to uh, 2004 CR125. All right, here we go. Oh, that's a nice one. Yeah, that's a nice one. Yeah, that's a nice one. Still pushing. <laughs> I'll pack it in there too, a little bit. Okay. I'll pack it in. Wait, hey, you got your dad riding? Heck yeah! <laughs> well, like, no one knows what's going on. So sorry. We must be in the first one. <laughs> no, I'm stuck. I don't know. 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 First lap of his first moto, right before the whoops. So I'm uh, realigning the whole front end. The radiator got ripped off and the cap got all screwed up, so I had to straighten all that stuff out. Add coolant back to it. It lost about a quarter of the coolant. Levers and stuff were all jacked up, so working on the bike, getting the alignment straightened out right now. But uh, he may or may not ride. He hit his, hit his stomach pretty hard in the handlebars. And so we'll see. We'll see what goes down. But, Try and get the bike ready for him. He, when he crashed, the, the CDI box and everything twisted and it hung up the handlebar so you couldn't steer. So, putting old Humpty Dumpty back together again here. I think I'm gonna change uh, some rebound settings in the rear end too. This seems a little, a little goofy. <laughs> bike was uh, donated last minute. It's kind of a little bit of a, it's not a basket case. It's a, it's a decent bike. It just wasn't looked over real well. I found lots of, lots and lots of loose stuff and thought i had it pretty good for him but front end just kind of tucked on him a little bit going in the corner uh gets slick back there in the woods so he probably just you know got got screwed up in the woods a little bit but yeah i took out the whole front end of the bike i had to rebuild it here real quick just got his next moto coming up so i gotta go i can't film all that for you but uh yeah yeah we're having fun here at the 125 dream race now this is the dream race, no competition. Yeah. <laughs> So I got Ryan's bike back together and, uh, and his other bike also. And he just rode the uh, 40 plus last chance qualifier. He only rode one lap. <laughs> and he won that by like a quarter track. So he got him, uh, got him set up and qualified for the, uh, the main in the uh, 40 plus class. So, all right, we're good to go. And then next uh, we're on the the 2.2 Honda, the 79, I'll show you that. He's going head to head. Going head to head with uh, Ricky in that moto.
lean your bike over and put it on the ground, but I didn't want it not to start. <laughs> hey Ryan, is that uh, Justin Barsha? Uh, yeah, Justin Barsha's grandpa. <laughs> it's 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 a uh, boom boom, not bam bam. <laughs> I just saw the hair and the red bike. Yeah. Nah, he thinks he's somebody, but he's nobody. Boom boom, not bam bam. Well, we meet again, Rhino. We meet again, Mr. Roger. You know what? You might have caught me at a bad moment at one point, you know. Yeah, having down time, yeah. What kind of a queer French name is uh, Roger? Well, is that French or is that, uh, you is know, that, uh, Eastern German the, or is that just because you're a pussy? Well, you know, the roadster, yeah. as much as he does not ever want to offend people, we are in the Portland area. And, uh, you know, there's a lot of trannies and, you know, kind of a lot of gayness going around. Six feet trannies? So in, <laughs> yes. in order to kind of move amongst them, Rosé, you know, it sounds a little, you know, yeah. it gets fixed and it kind of, of Antifa yeah. doesn't sabotage, the Ricky sabotage is a, your bike. I'm a man of the people. I'm like, Rhino. I'm the man, I'm a man of the gods. Sorry. He's the man of men. Yeah, he's the man of the people, I'm the man of the gods, so <laughs> that's where we, we, we're different. Well, we'll see. We'll see about that here real soon. Hey, hey, uh, hey go up front. Hey, go up front take a video of this. First interview here. Got Danny Name, number, da da da. Just number make sure man. Just having fun, gonna go ahead and go fast, take chances. Yeah. Johnny O's gonna take chances. Uh, we know this guy. You know me? Yeah, I'm Rad Rhino. Brought out my new 22 oh, I seven nine I saw you were uh, Chad Reed. Yeah, no, I, I was the first 22 in 94. <laughs> in 94, I won this race on a 125. So uh, we're just bringing it back. I got some some quack job called Ricky Roger. And he's uh, he's a gay guy. tranny. He's a gay tranny. If you've ever heard of that, he has his own his own genre of gay tranny. Lucky for this guy, Ricky was in a coma during the 90s. But. The Roaster's back, ready to straighten this place out. Yeah, we'll see, man. Oh yeah. Back. And we got one more. I think he's a. I think he came from like South America. He's like yeah. a, a champion down there. Like can't help That's him. world yeah. champion. Yeah. Cowboy. Triple one. Cowboy. Three world champions like Bale. Right. <laughs> hey, is that John McGill? Yeah, one more. And then those guys. <laughs> Run the 111 for yeah. the international champion. What's your story? Oh, not a whole lot. 41 on an 87 CR500 from a guy in uh, from California. Nice. Barely rode it before I bought it. Thought maybe you were John Dowd. No, sir. Straight out of the junkyard. Yeah. I'm just trying to hold on. <laughs> Take care, man. Shitty plug or something. Yeah, I'm wondering if it fouled the plug. Yeah, because it's never had a, uh, it's never loaded up, you know? Yeah, I know. The choke's off and everything? Yeah, well, I turned it on and off, on and off, so to. Let me put together the plug right here. Yeah, I mean, it's, 
pretty much done unless I do one lap. Yeah. Right when I took off, it was good on the liner. Yeah, yeah, yeah. As soon as he came off the gate, it's fucking dead. 79 technology. Yeah, I don't, I don't know if it doesn't sound like a foul plug, though. I don't know in this race if it's for gate pick or what. It doesn't matter. All right. All right. Let's try, try it. Let's see if it'll go. <laughs> Did you? Yeah. yeah. The thing was running good and I take off more. Boom, boom, boom. And I'm like, fucker. So I thought you pulled my choke up or did something, so I'm checking. Dude, I'm just starting it. Bump started, started, bump started. Then I went over and changed the plug. <laughs> so, yeah, that was good. Well, you know what they say? If you ain't cheating, you ain't trying. <laughs> Stay hungry. Put that line through the <laughs> coming down, down back down here. Put that, put that breaking bump. I think I'm just cut that corner. Oh, yeah. Just cut that fucking corner. Yeah.
Good, dude. Fun, man. Yeah, it's cool. That was yeah, good. I wish I had the arms to stay with me. Yeah, I wish I had to bike that thing front end. Yeah. Clutch, dude. Clutch. They get battle. Yeah, you pulled it back in with your legs a few times. That yeah, was awesome. Yeah, that clutch doesn't even work. Whoever uses this, I don't know why people use this after working. I'm an OEM guy for Henson or Clues. Yeah. Everything OEM. Great ride, guys. Thanks, man. <laughs> yeah, what a piece of shit that bike is. <laughs> yeah. So slow. Well, what do people think that they're making fast bikes? I don't think they know what fast bikes are. That's slow as shit. The other bike is a pile of shit. And they're saying that they're rippers. Yeah. Dude. You're way down to staging. Actually, you should be in staging right now. All 125. Come on, Ricky, you got this! Down to <laughs> staging. Oh, man, Ricky Rose having a problem. He's been pushing his bike. I think he's been pushing his bike since about high two seven. Here he comes, pushing it through the loops. As the one. Trying to cheer him on. The checkered flag comes out, I think, uh... The great Gregory N. Crater from Rick, Washington is going to get the win on that one as Rogue tries to make his way all the way to the finish and gets an earful from Hughes. Never, ever, you'll never be me! Ever, 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 you understand that? As Ricky Rogue... No chain. Oh, I blew the transmission. Oh, you have to take the chain off. I blew the transmission. Oh, where the fuck's the chain? Man, Ryan said I you should have pushed, just... pushed that son of a bitch, man. I did. You did? <laughs> no shit, dude. You fucking still blew pushing. off. I thought it was a tranny, because I'm in Portland area. <laughs> oh, God. Have a good one, man. Thank you, brother. Thank God, no tranny stranger. Those damn trannies. They'll get you every time. Yeah. But. Not this time. I feel bad for them. I apologize to all the trannies out there. I blew out my chain. <laughs> What a quid ink Well, at least you had Rhino to kick your ass in What a quid ink <laughs> There you have it, folks. But not so great, Ricky. Pushed his bike back into the track, all the way through the whoops. Only to get his ass kicked by Rhino once again. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm setting up a badminton course here soon. Yeah. 
Rhino can't touch Ricky Rogan bad, man. Hey, it hits out, man. I bet he can. Yeah. Oh, no. My second cousin's John McEnroe. Uh, okay. All right, we better get this guy a fresh beer or something. Oh, beer me. <laughs> oh. Oh. One more moto. <laughs> Pipes on this. I was thinking about it. Last Make it twice as fast. Oh yeah. Obviously, it needs more stickers. <laughs> Okay. Can you feel that? Yeah. And that? Yeah. All right. That's How about good. here, bud? How about here? You feel that? Yeah. You yeah. feel that? I won't go that high. Huh? For you. You feel no, he, just, no, he doesn't have I good movement. You feel my he hands, just doesn't okay? have good movement, you guys. Right. Yeah, 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 just, yeah, it was a good GL. Yeah. Yeah. Hang on. Ready? What's the matter? Yeah, this sweatshirt's hooked up. I don't want to so much. Okay. Yeah. Gee, Merry Christmas, dude. You are solid. We need to get him all the way forward. Yeah. 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 You were like trying to get up underneath it, right? And I think it's going to come back slowly, the feeling will be so if you feel like moving, it's okay, just move around, just don't move too much, alright bud? Hey, 
let's go to his rig. His rig? Well, we got right over the there. Well, this is the best spot for okay. him. Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay. Don't get up. Yeah, I don't want anybody to go. Let's um, yeah. take this shit off. What do you mean? Uh, uh, Alma's yeah. staying on. Okay. Alma's staying on. Fuck it. Okay. Breathing. Hopefully I didn't break my neck. All right, right now pain is good, bud. Yeah, it shows you're here you know. and feeling it all. Yeah. You know that conversation. Coming back in the fingers. Yeah, my, my toes, left yeah. toes moving? Yeah, they're working. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Look yeah. Good. Everything's look, looks good. Everything's good. How so about this? I know where we need yeah. to get it. Okay. Up here. Yeah. You feel all of it? Yeah. Down here? Yeah, just taking you down here. Hips? Yeah. Oop. Belly? Yeah. Alright. Get that tap going. Get done, dude. Yeah, we're done. Alright. Yeah, dude, I can't move my fingers. Try not to move yeah, my just, arms. Just, try to lay there still. Yeah. I'm just. I know you. I know you. Just relax. Breathe, Alright, I'm cutting your shirt, bud. I'll get you flushed today. Not yet. Okay, he is, but the paramedics are working on him, so they, they didn't want me to have the phone in his face. Okay, hang tight. Yep. So, who, uh, who knows him? Um, all of us do okay. really, really well. Uh, sorry. No, he's he's in the in the paramedic unit. Uh, he, he's a little bit nervous because of, you know, the past things that have happened to him. Um, should, I think I'll call you back with my phone and I'll give his phone to him so that he has it at the hospital. Okay, so I'm going to hang up because Okay, I'll, I'll let you know. I'll call you back on my phone. Um, oh, wait, you okay. want to know where he's going? No, not yet. I'll let you know what hospital he's going to before it's around. Okay. Should I get in there? Uh, if you want, I gotta, I gotta drive out. Yeah, I'll just come to you. Um, I just wanna make, he asked me to go with him. Yeah, yeah, you can come with me, absolutely. No, like, he asked me to go with him. Oh, okay. Okay, I'm okay. just making sure, he asked, I'm just yeah. making sure. So they're gonna go in and fix a couple discs. One disc below is just worn out from years and years and years. So they're gonna go in there, put a little bone in there, boom, boom. And then the one above it, they're gonna do the same thing because that one got a little bit, uh, smashed so they're gonna do that and then they're gonna fuse me from c5 to 7 and then i should be on the airplane tomorrow going home so that's the uh the case uh yeah this is what we do we pick a sport that's dangerous we pick a sport that uh can take you down but unfortunately i guess we're all blessed with stupidity <laughs> or such a deep passion that we don't stop but um yeah Another lesson learned, my friends. But anyways, thank you all for all the concern, for all the love, uh, for that. But Rhino ain't stopping. You won't see him race anymore, but uh, he's still going to be preaching, teaching, and uh, helping everybody out in this world in motocross. So uh, again, everybody, I'm good, and I'll be back at it. Peace, my friends. Oh, oh man. I don't know how to stop. <sighs> Just got so emotional from being home, walking through the airport. Man, no emotion ever came up until now. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. I can't believe I did it. One, breaking my neck. Two, being strong enough to survive it. Three, going through it. And four, getting home. <laughs> I didn't, I did not think this was going to come up. But I just want to share it with you guys and see that it's not all fun and games. And I'm not all just tough, man. No idea. No idea. Ooh. The emotion that's coming out right now from just being able to walk and get home by yourself. Yeah. Anybody going through anything, man, you can get through anything, I promise you. I promise you. You can get through anything. The body is strong. The mind is strong. The will is strong. You just can't. You just can't give up. You can't get attached to it. 
you guys gotta know you're a warrior and anybody struggling out there man it's okay it's okay to be sad it's okay to cry it's okay to sometimes give up but on the other hand you never give up all right there you have it pretty wild weekend huh what do you guys think about that yeah pretty uh pretty crazy ryan um basically crashed somewhere around uh 5 p.m i think 5 30 maybe and uh was at the hospital by about seven uh had three three vertebrae get fused uh compressed uh c5 broken c6 dislocated and uh, already damaged c7 and they had him in surgery um noon the next day and uh he beat me home so i was on the phone till uh, 5 a.m on monday um trying to get information finding doctors neurosurgeons and stuff uh filling in his family and, and friends and stuff and yeah it was wild he was in the hospital fused walking out and be home home before i got home <laughs> so pretty pretty crazy uh pretty miraculous um got lucky this is a this is a dangerous sport we all know it and uh you know the the, the guy that he raced there in that last moto that he won um ryan huffman he's the guy that owns uh the track there at washugal yeah you know, he broke his neck last year too so this is this is real stuff and uh, you know you just have to remember that uh you know things can happen as we get older you just take a little bit more patience and uh, just be a little bit a little bit more calm about things and uh, that's what I'm trying to do in you know kind of my older riding age and learning how to ride safer and and just just less wild in general but you know when you when you get good and you learn you end up going faster speeds and faster speeds start breaking stuff so I don't know we just got to just got to learn from the lessons and uh, or the bad things anyway and uh, that's, that's all we can do so I hope you guys uh, like these vlogs uh, there, there may be another one I don't know I got a bunch of footage to go through but uh, for now we'll call this uh, the second to the last one <laughs> take care